All right, we are on the road. Well, we're not quite on the road yet, but we're getting close. Zoe so okay. turned to Wu. Do something! Heading back home from Bemidji. Um, there's a pretty heavy wind that is coming in from the south, which is exactly the direction that I am driving, so my gas mileage is going to suck. Windows are down and back for the dogs, and well, that's about it for now. Probably check in when we get to Motley or somewhere in between. See ya. Oh. Come here. Yep, you went around me again. Come on. I call this place the Shrine of the Dear God. We usually stop here on the way down. It's an access for the power line, and this is a place where the highway workers, you know, they dump snow and anything else that's sissy. Ah, uh -uh. you know, like the the deer carcasses that are hit on the uh, on the road. But it's got this large space and there's things for the dogs to sniff and places to go potty and all that other fun stuff and strange looking dead trees hello This is dirty. Yeah. Okay, poop it, there's water. <laughs> what is up with that? You are a silly sister. You want the rest of the water? You want the rest of the water? No, you want me to pour new water? There you go. Let's see, he's just getting it again. I, I, you, you gotta get some water, dude. If you want some water, you better get it. Yeah. Are you gonna get the water? You gonna get the water? See, she's gonna drink all of it. A collapsible water bowl. And this is the actual shrine. Everything is staying attached on the trailer. Uh, I'm going to have to do something about tie downs because this is missing a lot of them. And I'm probably going to have to get some more bungee cords and straps. Okay. It's a fairly nice day, other than that wind. Um, but we're going to get back on the road. The traffic seems pretty decent. It's, I mean, there's more cars now, I guess, probably because it's Saturday. But it is what it is. So 
back on the road. Stopped at the dog park in Motley. Piper was howling most of the way. I figured she probably had to poop. Yeah. No, she just wanted to go out and sniff stuff. Be in the middle, but but uh, we're here. Gonna take a break. Wander around a little bit. It's kind of it's a good place to be. It's but it's like halfway point. It's it's close. So. Stuff still staying on the trailer okay? Uh, wind is just outrageous. Um, so, yeah, uh, my gas mileage is horrible. So, I think I'm hovering somewhere around 15 right now. The joy. All right, talk to you later. Leaving Motley. I'm going to try and get this thing out on the road again. Driving with the trailer is, uh, of course, a different thing entirely. Having awareness of it, where it is, and what you have to do. lower it makes you on um, pulling on through the roads and things. Yeah, the wind, I just, the wind is amazing today. I mean, I, it was on the way up too, so it's pretty, uh, I'm only getting some of the headwind. A lot of it is trying to push me this way. Just, just loads of fun. All right, onward and forward. We'll see where we stop next. long drive. That was uh, close to six hours. That's one of the longer drives that I've had. I think part of it was because I was going slower with the trailer. Kind of limited my top speed to about 60. Um, but just the gas mileage above that was just hell abysmal. So yeah, home, unpacking. Uh, Got to move the tra trailer over and park it in its place. And uh, unload and then try to unwind oh gotta feed the dogs too so yeah all right well that was the trip <laughs>